guys, so today I am going to do something extremely quick. Um, I was asked from a friend of mine um, if I knew how to give an illusion that your nose is a little bit smaller. So to be honest guys, I'm a little nervous because I usually work with my nose. So uh, I'm going to try my best and I hope that this will help my friend. Um, she stated that she feels like her nose is a little bit longer. Okay, so typically my nose, um, I usually put two lines here and make it smaller. Um, I do have a, like a little crooked nose. Um, it's not crooked, it has like a little bone that it, whenever I put the, um, the, the cream, the contour cream on here, it kicks it out and I have a hell of a time contouring my nose. With hers, she said that hers is a little longer and just to kind of give an illusion that her nose is a little shorter, not as long. Okay, so this is what I think that she should do. Okay, so I'm gonna get my NYX Sculpting Highlighting. And I'm gonna put the cream, the highlighter right in the middle. Okay, so then I'm gonna use the other side of the NYX. And what you do is, right next to the highlight, you put two lines down your nose and I like to go up like right in here kind of like going into my eyebrows okay guys and the other side as well Now I have to be very careful right here because my nose, like I said, is really crooked and it kicks it out. If you notice it kicks it out. The it kicks it kicks the brush out. Okay, so now with someone that has a longer nose, what you do is get a like a synthetic brush like this and you do a triangle here, but then you also paint go all the way down with the dark and in here guys so it gives an illusion that your nose is shorter okay see that okay so moving on now get a small little sponge um, the little tiny ones and they sell these as Sephora and what you do is kind of tap that darkness and if you want you can use your finger sometimes your finger works as well as your little sponge now get another little sponge that actually so far sells these two together in the in the little kit so you'll have two of them and wet make sure you wet your sponge guys it's just easier to blend in and tap that um, concealer highlighting cream into your nose and tap it in instead of rubbing so once you're done that guys go back with your highlighter and go right next to the dark and put two lines right next to the dark and kick it out And tap it in and kick it out like I don't I don't know if you understand when I say kick it out it's just kind of like brushing it up and not not too much not rubbing it too much and 
And if you want, you can go back in the middle. Okay guys, and then you can get a translucent powder and put it on your nose because it's a cream guys, you want to make sure that you put a translucent powder on so that cream doesn't rub throughout the day. then after you're done and you put that translucent powder on what you can do is put a highlight on where you want people to focus their eye on instead of um, focusing the eye on the longer part where it's dark you highlight the parts that you want them to look at so look at look at so I'm gonna highlight my nose here this is for longer nose like usually I highlight my nose down here but if you don't want people to look on down here, you highlight up here. And you highlight in here. And of course your cheekbones. I know your cheekbones have nothing to do with your nose, but you want people to look at the highlighted areas so they won't see the longer nose. For my type of nose, I do highlight my the tip of my nose, but if you have a longer nose, you don't want to have people focus on that area so you don't want to highlight here you just want to highlight here 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 and above your lip okay guys so this is my end result I hope that it helped my girlfriend out a bit of understanding um, how to minimize the length of your um, nose and yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please thumbs it up, please comment, and please guys subscribe. Thank you.